Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Ashi Adani and for today's video, I'm going to be taking you through my Amazon obsessions. So let's get started. Now, I'm not using the word obsessions lightly over here. I am obsessed with these products. I use them probably every single day. They are something I can't do without and they've made my life so much easier. And I hope they do the same for you, which is why I'm sharing them today. Starting with this styling tool. Now, this one is from Iconic. It's their 28mm barrel. And I think this is my most used styling tool. Any video you see of mine where I have curly hair, this is the product I've used. Like today also to get these loose waves, I've used this product. When I want tight curls also, I use less hair and I get tight waves with this product. It's such a nice heat styling tool. I think this is the only one which makes my curls actually stay till my next wash which is a lot to say because my hair like that is very silky so you know no hairstyle kind of stays on it at all and i think i've been using this one since three years now and i absolutely love it and the second most used product in the hair care category for me is this love beauty and planet heat protection conditioning mist with argan oil now uh, why i like this one it's a leave-in conditioner plus a heat protectant in one which is great because it makes your hair more manageable and it protects it from heat and another thing it smells like argan oil which i absolutely love and it keeps my hair like this like shiny manageable whatever and two things that i hate about this product is this one is the stupid cap it does not stay on like if i drop the product the cap is going to go somewhere if i put it in a bag the cap is going to go somewhere it's very loose which i don't like a mistake i used to make with this product was applying it generously all over my hair which made my roots get oily faster because they're generally very oily so i now what i do is i apply a generous layer of it from here onwards and just for the heat protection element i use a very quick spritz all over my roots just to make sure my hair doesn't get oily oily too fast but other than that it's a great product next we've got two gadgets that i use very often first is this mobi life uh, tripod i recently got my hands on this one i don't know if you've seen my video on instagram i used to have a tripod about this size like it was really tiny perfect to travel with it would go in my smallest handbag but the thing with that tripod very short in height it was three and a half feet this is about five and a half and i'm five two so this will take like full body shots very easily also this is very very sturdy okay that one used to um that one was very lightweight so it could not even take the weight of my phone so i could not ever mount my camera on it but my phone also has fallen couple of times from it because it could not take the weight of it even another thing it used to do was um you know fly off if the wind was too strong so it was easy to carry but it was not a very helpful product after a point because i was just like i have to keep adjusting it so i got something more sturdy this is definitely bigger but it's taller plus it has uh, the attachment where so i can mount my phone on it very easily very expandable but i can also remove this use the attachment which comes with it to mount my camera on it it also has this remote for bluetooth control with your phone so if your phone is mounted on it you can bluetooth control it and it'll take the pictures from far which is very cool and this goes on you guys like it's five and a half feet and um you can see it's taller than me uh that's okay uh and yeah so i haven't yet gotten a chance to travel with it but when i'm shooting at home right now a couple of reels i've been shooting on my phone and it's very nice to um carry around it's very useful it's not that heavy also so i really like it next gadget that i have is a power bank now i don't know what it was through college i've had the worst luck with power banks either they used to die on me or they didn't charge my phone fast enough or they broke like i don't know what it was it was just i was not having good luck with power banks uh so i stopped using them completely for like five five and a half years and um it was until april that we were going to rishikesh from riddle's wedding and then Alfie and I were going to Delhi where both places we were vlogging so we needed our cameras and phones to be properly charged which is why we both got this together by the way so uh, yes it is a little bulky and it is definitely a little heavy but oh my god does it work it works like a beast I don't remember the last time I've charged this and I carry it around everywhere I, I'll just keep it in my car basically so wherever I'm going 
need to charge my phone i can like keep it on me even when i go to singapore i kept this in i took a bigger bag because i was like i cannot go without my power bank not only did it charge my phone it charged two other influencers phones because they all were vlogging and nobody had a power bank and everybody's battery was dying and this has come in really really handy it also my small vlogging camera has this chotu wala pin so it I, i can charge my vlogging camera with it as well which is amazing i'm i'm really happy to finally have a power bank which i can rely on which i don't feel stressed about that oh my battery i'm one of those people i will not leave my house till my battery is 100% i will not okay i get very restless i if my phone is at 82% also i'm like nahi charge me dalo this has really calmed that down because sometimes if i'm filming like a get ready with me before leaving the house my battery is going to go and i just to make me feel safer and more calm i think this has helped a lot next is home care now i'm not a passionate furniture interior designer person like i really I'm not but two things that I really like to make my studio because studio is technically my home now because my friends come over here they chill over here so whenever they come or if I'm throwing a party over here I like to do a few things so one of them is having candles now I've been obsessed with Bath and Body Works candles for the longest time but my god they are so expensive and the rate at which I use candles it's getting me broke okay so i received this vida candle in my pr box in one diwali hamper or something and i was using it and i was obsessed with it like it had the strong fragrance that i really really like not something that once you enter the room you can't smell it anymore it is something you can smell through and through which i absolutely love and um, this is one i bought on my own because that one got over uh, this is a musky candle so it's very like strong and it also smells like roses and it also smells like like i don't know woody floral fragrance which is very nice it's not sweet at all and um, yeah i'm like re- if you're someone who is into scented candles you might want to consider this brand very good and something you might not know about me is that i suck at using matchsticks okay i don't know how to do it it scares me which is why like थोड़ा भी ऐसे आएगा द फ्लेम आई लाइक बी लाइक नहीं सो लाइटिंग अर दिया टेक्स मी फिफ्टीन मैच टेक्स सो बेसिकली आई गॉट माई हैंड्स ऑन दिस इलेक्ट्रिकल वन विच आई लव बिकॉज इट डजेंट हैव अ फ्लेम फ्लेम इज समथिंग दैट स्केयर्स मी सो दिस डज नॉट हैव अ फ्लेम विच इज अमेजिंग दिस ऑल्सो बेंड्स एंड इट कैन गो इन साइड सो इवन इफ योर कैंडल इज गेटिंग ओवर यू डोंट नीड टू लाइक कीप टेल्टिंग इट दिस विल इट सेल्फ गो इन साइड एंड इट ऑल्सो कम्स विद अ टाइनी वायर सो यू कैन चार्ज इट एंड इट्स वेरी सेफ बिकॉज वंस you turn it on then you can use it otherwise you know if it's turned off and someone keeps pressing the button nothing's going to happen which is really cool you can see how much battery it has because it has these lights to indicate that and yeah i feel like i am someone who is obsessed with candles and i really like this one i don't know why and it's very cool to mess around with also like don't play with it but like just to see it do that thing is very cool next we've got food okay two things like विंटर चालू भी नहीं हुआ एंड आई एम लाइक विंटर्स कमिंग वे इज माई हॉट चॉकलेट आई एम दैट पर्सन आई नीड हॉट चॉकलेट इन विंटर अंटिल नाउ आई वॉज यूजिंग हर्शीज हॉट चॉकलेट पाउडर एंड इट डेंट फील रिच और थिक और इंडलजेंट एंड माई ब्रदर रिसेंटली इन राखी गॉट मी दिस कैडबेरी हॉट चॉकलेट लाइक एज अ पार्ट ऑफ अ हेम्पर एंड आई स्टार्टेड यूजिंग इट लाइक कपल ऑफ वीक्स बैक एंड आई एम ड्रिंकिंग हॉट चॉकलेट ऑलमोस्ट एवरी सिंगल डे every single day you guys it's so yummy it's so nice it's like a nice sweet treat yes it has calories lots but i mean like i told you it's a non negotiable for me in winters i plan to order marshmallows also to go with it because it's so good it tastes really nice and yeah and it smells really good i can also eat this just powder raw because it tastes so good going completely opposite from the sweet we've got spicy this is the kya piri piri instant multi purpose spice mix it's mcdonald's ka piri piri masala which you get in full quantity and i absolutely love it now you can cry about it you can bitch about it you can be mean to me about it but i use this on almost every single thing probably my sixth bottle it it it's so yummy it makes everything spicy so if you're someone who just needs that kick of spice don't go around with tabasco go around with piri piri masala it's so good also 
is it piri piri or it's piri piri is it piri piri or piri piri because i said piri piri that's too much so yeah i mean it, it i don't know what else to say about it you can make any dish spicier and more flavorful with this if you don't like your mom ki loki ki sabzi maybe put some masala on it i don't know and last we've got an intimate feminine hygiene category i thought of adding it because they are useful product since i got my period in school i have been using pads different types of pads whisper stay free normal usual but i have an ick okay which is panty line like i cannot if i see a panty line i'll get irritated so um, i make sure to never have one but if you are on your period you have to wear your pads so you are going to have a panty line so i have to always like compromise on the kind of clothes i was wearing now that is where my problem started and because obviously we go to so many events now if i end up having my period i can't usually just change my outfit because what if it's sourced what if it's committed to a brand or something like that and so that's where i was like maybe i need to switch to tampons now i wore my first tampon and to a dance class I don't know dance class. I was like, this is where I will experiment. It was like my third day, and I wore it. And guys, you don't feel a thing. You don't feel a thing. I don't know how to explain it. You can go commando. You can wear whatever you want. You can be in whatever position you want. It's not going to leak. It's not going to like get messy. It's not going to do anything. It's just there, and you don't even realize. You know. how much you don't realize it when you sneeze you don't feel like you're on your period if you know you know right and uh, it's such a god sent like it's made my life so much easier most of the times you don't even realize you're on your period because it's taking care of the problem from within so it's not really uncomfortable just a psa i would if you're someone young i would recommend you speaking to your gynec or your mother before you start using something like this and uh, always make sure to change it every 3 4 hours so really like it made my life so much easier i've converted i think two three of my friends into this because it really makes your life so much easier and the last thing we have is the answer to one of the most asked questions whenever i wear something revealing it's what are you wearing inside <laughs> so um yes i wear a lot of like backless clothes and deep neck lines and what like what not i love wearing like fun kata hua idhar se udhar clothes so this is the answer it is a silicone bra and it has been with me through so many outfits i probably own like eight of these because i use them that often when i'm going on vacation i don't even carry normal bras because all my outfits are a way which will require this it also provides a nice lift you guys if you are someone who's into push up bras you can create a push up bra with this like it's so good it's not uncomfortable if you do sweat a lot it might be tricky because um only one time i had a problem with this product i was in thailand and i was dancing for like 5 hours after a point got really sweaty and this just like the grip went away basically it didn't go away i just had to like press it back and it was back in position but that was the first time i felt like oh shit if i'm sweating a lot this could be a problem but if you don't oh my god this is a god send you guys like it just takes you can use it i would say about 7 to 8 times before the tack goes away and i always keep these plastic things which come with it to make sure no dust or anything sticks to it and you can always separate it and use it like this if you're wearing like a super deep neckline you can put it on like this also and yeah i mean you see any pack with me videos of mine i'm always packing like 3 4 of these because i love them so much and i have a friend who has a much heavier bust than mine she also uses these and is very comfortable with them so maybe give it a shot and that's about it for today's video if you guys enjoyed it then please make sure to like it subscribe to my channel comment below and let me know which of these products you'd like to try out i'll see you guys next saturday bye